Hello everybody, this is Dream Gamer back for another Jurassic World Evolution 2 video. Ooh, we got something big planned because we have got, well, we got a lot of dinosaurs, over 50 species, and they're all going to go at it in my new and improved battle arena. Yes, remember this arena from like eons ago when it had the big thingy? And yes, we had the uh, 30th anniversary update thingy, my body, so we got some new cool cosmetics to play with. So we got this little uh, Muriel here. We also have this little Jurassic Park area with a meat feeder. We got an emergency bunker. We got this cool little shot for the tall jeeps. We got some new trees. So basically, recently the game updated. We had lots of new decorations and stuff like that. So I've decided to amp up the battle arena a bit. We got this like little tropical zone over here. As for the now, we have got well over fifty dinosaurs because I've finally been able to figure out how to do new cosmetics. Like, honestly, do you want to know why my cosmetics weren't working at the beginning? It was because I forgot to change one name in one of the um, tech, in one of the files. One name stopped my cosmetics from working. But now they're working. Well, hey! So look at all these beauties. And yeah, they all have this um, Acrocamphosaurus pick here because I haven't done the icons yet. Well, I've done the icons for some, but not all of them. So as you can see here, we have a gut ton of Allosauruses and Acros and stuff. And I did test this, and this does work. They do, well, they do work, and they do fight each other. <laughs> I did have one slight issue, though, and that, if I can find it, was the Baby Maya, because originally I made the Baby Maya a cosmetic of the Myasaur. But for whatever reason, nothing would attack it. It would say it's hunting it, and then they would just not kill it. So I think the animations are a bit broken there, so... There are limitations to doing new cosmetics. And you might be asking yourself, why why not just make them into new species? Because that takes three hours to do a new species. <laughs> and it takes 15 minutes to do a new cosmetic. It's a no-brainer. Right, without further ado, let's release all these puppies. <laughs> Alright, so here we are. We have released everything, practically. Uh, what should we go through first? Okay, so here's Joboria as a new cosmetic. Although it doesn't actually say it's a Joboria cosmetic, but it is. And, one of the newest additions, we have the return of Brontokit. Well, Apatosaurus, not Brontokins. And yeah, like the Joboria, it does have weird texture thingies, but yeah, I think it's to do with the blend weights, but I'm not sure how to fix them without breaking the game, so... <laughs> Until I figure that out, you'll just have to put up with that weird texture. There's a Myasaur there. Oh, here's a new one. 
if I can click on it. Yes, ladies and gentlemen, we have a Sorolophus. Now, what was interesting about this one, if the dinosaurs were all shut up, <laughs> is that um, originally wanted to port it onto the other Iguanodon model, like the big one, because Iguanodon has two in this game. You have this one, with the, which is more quadruped, and then that one by there. Now, the problem with this one over here the, is that it's the feet, it's the front feet. So when porting any other of these hadrosaurs over to that model you have to do a lot of editing and weight painting with these front with the front feet to get it to look weird and i just couldn't do it and yeah it, it was very broken which is a shame but yeah weight painting while well, i can do it i'm not very good at it <laughs> and yeah again i think a little texture issue with a beak there that i need to fix but yes this is our sorolophus ladies and gentlemen ah oh, look at zuni ceratops there Chasmosaurus variant. So yeah, some cosmetics are a little bit weird, like the... Uh... Ah, here we are. Yes, this is a bit weird, because this is obviously Dinochirus. And you might be thinking, hang on a minute, why, you put why not put Pachycephalosaurus as a Pachycephalosaurus cosmetic? Now, I did that, and this thing was unable to fight. And it got hunted down and killed by everything instantly, so... For the sole purpose of it being able to fight, I had to put it on Dinochira. So I don't know how that's going to work. And while we're here, the newest addition to the arena, the return of Gojira... Yes, all right. The return of Gojirasaurus. Fresh from my... Fresh from Evolution 1, ported over on the Harara rig. Looking pretty good there. Oh, oh except for that uh, belly glitch. Sorrow Pelter making its debut here. We saw it in the uh, Apex Arena video. Oh, another returning dinosaur, the Afrovenator. This time, though, on the Ceratosaurus rig. Closer to its actual size, and yeah. The teeth are kind of screwed. I think, again, that's blend weight pattern issue thingy that I have yet to fix. Uh, what else do we have? Well, oh, we've got the return of Allosaurus Atrox. We've got Yangchunosaurus here as an acro cosmetic but it does have the allosaurus animations and such we have torvosaurus i oh oh torvosaurus having a go at the cars in i finally fixed the arms so they don't look broken we have dealt the dromius another allosaurus cosmetic <laughs> gonna be a lot of them and speaking of allosaurus cosmetics of course sir ophagonax is one there's Albertosaurus, I think, making its debut here. With a bit of a texture issue there. So, Gorgosaurus making a return. A lot of people like Gorgosaurus in this in the dinosaur game. I like it as well. It's a pretty cool dinosaur. Ooh, we got Cychania. Not a cosmetic yet. Basically, I, I focus on doing cosmetics like the Sorophagonax, Deltadromius. Dinosaurs that use the same model and rig. Oh, there's Modelophosaurus there making a return. Mapusaurus making its debut in Evolution 2. <laughs> a lot to go through here. We have Black T-Rex. Hopefully going to do better this time. Because it didn't do well. But it'll have the fiery wrath of Alpha Acrocamphosaurus to contend with. Is our Shand looking to make an impact on the carnivores? Eocarcaria as well. Yeah, funny enough, when I did the uh, Eocarcaria cosmetic, for some reason it didn't count as a variant. I'll show, I'll show you real quick. It, it didn't count. It just gave us an, gave me another set of patterns, which is the Eocarc patterns. Weird. Is there anyone that's happened to it so far? Yes, another cosmetic variant. The Deinonychus, but the normal Deinonychus. Not the Alpha Deinonychus. So we have four of these guys, I think. Oh, no, just the three, like in the show. So we got the Alpha Deinonychus and the two normal Deinonychus. Oh, actually, last thing. A Stegosaurus ported over from Evolution 1. Again, some texture issues by you. I think that's, that's fi that should be fixable. I've had quite a lot of problems with this Stegosaurus, to be honest. And this, at the minute, is, as far, is the best I can do. <laughs> and now I'm starting to think... My wasted my time porting it over. I should have just made the skin from scratch because it's not a terribly tricky texture to do. Ah, there's our champ, the Spinosaurus. It's probably going to win again. Although, it has a lot more competition this time. Right, I think that's enough going through all the uh, new newcomers. Let's get started.
Right, place your bets. Who do you think's gonna win? Who do you think's gonna die first? And if you put place your bet on Spinosaurus, then yeah, you you know do it. You're gonna probably win. <laughs> Ooh, here we go. Ooh, we got Mapusaurus taking a crack at the Giga. Ooh, two carnivores not wasting any time getting involved. Mapusaurus was the apex champion in the apex arena, looking to make an impact. And actually, we got T Rex taking on Black T Rex. Ooh, Black T-Rex, I think, got the first hit. Yeah, oh, it didn't. Wait, what? This T-Rex hasn't been damaged? Hmm, the normal T-Rex winning. Interesting. Doesn't bode well for Black T-Rex. And it looks like the Mapusaurus won against the Giga. Yes, one thing I did notice about these fights is that because we got so many of the same species and they're all cosmetic variants, I notice that sometimes they'll like eye each other up and start the fight animation, but they won't actually fight, they'll just like walk around and then retreat. Oh, so Faganax having fun with the cars over there. Oh, uh, we got a valley over there of Def Alpha Acrocamphosaurus having a chill. Spinosaurus having a snooze there. Ah, oh, he's so cute. He's so cute, isn't he? There's the Mire at the back there, probably gonna last two seconds. Pop a comment down below. Do you think I should put the Maya on the Iguanodon rig so it can fight? Or do you think I should leave it as it is? Ooh, Gorgosaurus dealt the Dromius eye each other up. The blue, the true blues, these two are. The true blues. Oh, they are eyeing each other up. Oh, Gorgosaurus getting a cheap shot. Now, Delta the Dromius has Allosaurus as stats, so it should win. Because I think Allosaurus is better than Albertosaurus. But Gorgosaurus putting up a fight there, and I think did win the fight. Oh, Gorgosaurus showing Delta Dromius the who the true blue is. Taurosaurus there looking a lot better now than it used to be. Albertosaurus with his broken little skin set flap. Kark having a snooze. Is he a Patasaurus? Pachycephalosaurus, will you make an impact? Now, you should do better, actually, because you have Dinochirus' stats, and I think Dinochirus has better stats than Iguanodon. So, Pachycephalosaurus could be a dark horse. Oh, look at the baby Maya. <laughs> it probably lasts two seconds, love it. Okay, where are we going to now? Stegosaurus. Does anything die? Wait, is the T-Rex die? No, it's just sleeping. Oh, we got Ankyceratops. I forgot about you. <laughs> Oh, we're getting some backup there by the Triceratops and the Black T-Rex coming in to help. <laughs> Look at it, he's like sniffing it. He's like, yes. <laughs> Wait, what? Oh, the Joboria died. Hang on, what killed the Joboria? Wait, hang on, where is it? Oh, hang on, something died over here. Oh, Metricamphosaurus died. It's a CRT. Ooh, Taurosaurus, iron up the Apacosaurus there. Oh, there's the end of Monolophosaurus, wasted by a Frogonate. Honestly, why do these guys fight the big carnivores? They're not going to win. So who killed you? Fatally wounded by Mapusaurus. Oh, oh, there goes Stracosaurus, I think. And Lexovasaurus getting wasted in the background there by Alpha Acro. Yeah, these small herbivores stand zero chance. Oh, you got a minor fracture. This Plethosaurus has been in a fight with something. So Lexovasaurus gone, Mono gone, Met gone, Apatosaurus gone. Oh no, I think Ankyceratops is going to die. Go on, Ankyceratops, you can do it. Oh, he gets a head off. The green boy is going at it. SRP versus Kentrosaur. I think that's Sauropelta. Oh no, Ankyceratops is done. He's got internal bleeding. We got Sauropelta against Kentrosaurus. Ooh, Apatosaurus not in the best shape there. Ooh, uh, uh, Mapusaurus versus Torbosaurus. Oh, it's over there. Wait, hang on a minute. Oh, I just caught that. Yangchungosaurus smacking down the Albertosaurus. Wow, Albertosaurus is gone. Despletosaurus eyeing up Camarasaurus by the looks of it. Okay, who won this fight? 
Oh, I think it was a tie. PNT versus Delta Dromius. Pentaceratops taking on Delta Dromius. Ooh, uh, uh, yeah, look at the sort of Falconax watch in there. Ooh, Delta Dromius doesn't look in good shape. But still has enough power to beat the Pentaceratops. Ugh, this is what happens at the beginning. Everyone fights early, so I miss a lot of it. So we've got a Frovenator taking on Megalosaurus. This will be interesting. Oh, nope, nope, never mind. Oh, two Apexes going at it, and it's Kakirodontosaurus winning the clash. And Tajongosaurus did not survive against Gorgosaurus. Wait, we got a poison? No, oh, no, the Komarosaurus died. The Daspitosaurus finished him off. And it looks like a, pa a Patosaurus is about to join them. No, run, little fella, run. Oh, no, the Myosaurus is about to die. <laughs> no match for the Super Mimers. Right, I've missed a few fights. So, yeah, Anchiceratops got internal bleeding, so he's done. Myosaur is dead. Kamarasaurus is dead. Oh, look at that. Eocarcaria taking on Black T Rex. Oh, look at it towering over the Eocarcaria. Look at it. He's looking down on him. Do you notice his size? When you're that big, you can be a jerk. Whoa, Black T Rex gets the first hit. Can the Eocarcaria survive Black T Rex's overwhelming power? Doesn't look good. Oh, double cut off. Oh, Organ Trauma is not going to survive. The Black T Rex showing his overwhelming power against the Eocarcaria. Oh, Stegosaurus still alive and kicking. Oh, there's the other T Rex. Oh, look, Zuni Ceratops is still alive. With the Afrovenate design him up. Oh, I think I just jinxed. Oh, no. <laughs> the T Rex is eyeing him up. <laughs> okay. Oh, no. The God Wanna Titan died. Hunted down by Atrox. Oh. Daspeetosaurus taking on Megalosaurus here. No. <laughs> Oh, the, the Shunosaurus is about to die to Black T-Rex. Black T-Rex seen some action early on. And Matusaurus is doing a pose challenge, but looks at it. Oh, the Megalosaurus took a batter in there. Wait, Ceratosaurus died? Killed by Yangtonosaurus. And, uh, hello? Is anybody home? I think it's trying to fight the Polar Canthus, but uh, it's slowly making its way over. And yet, yeah, as I suspected, down goes Zuni Ceratops. Ah, I thought so. He's waiting for the Polar Canthus to come over to kill it. Smacked it against the car. Wow. Herbivores stand little chance, unless you're like a big brute like Stegosaurus. You stand Herbivores stand little chance in this game. Heartbreaking, really. I miss the good old days when, like, a polar canvas could kill a T-Rex. The glory years. Yep, yep, SPH. What's SPH? I think that's Sorophaganax. Right, let's have a sweep of the arena here to see what's died. Oh, oh, Pentaceratops just popped its cogs. Ooh, hang on. Alpha Acrocanthosaur is taking on an Iguanodon. Well, we know how this is going to end, even though Iguanodon can fight back. Oh no, down goes Iguanodon. Is this the end for Eocarcaria? Look at it, it's been battered by the out by the black T-Rex earlier and it's not in good shape. Ooh, he's backing down, but he's yeah, he's got organ trauma. It's done. Sukamimus. Will Sukamimus be the next victim of the black T-Rex? I mean it should be, like look at it. Black T-Rex yet again towering over its opponents. Oh, the Sukumimus, yeah, Sukumimus is dead. Organ Trauma and is at 4% health, is dead. Frobenita taking on the T-Rex. What are you doing to Frobenita? It's not going to end well for you, is it? The T-Rex is a brute. Nyom. 
Oh, poor thing. Oh, he gets a bite back. Oh, he's putting up the fight, but 32% playing 86%. I think we all know who's won. Oh, but the T-Rex decides to put him out of his misery. Playing a smackdown on a Frovenator. Wait, what? Giganonosaurus died? Fighting Yangchungasaurus? Wow, Yangchungasaurus. You're actually really strong. Ah, could you win it? Can Yangchungasaurus win it? Killed the Giganonis. Done a lot. It's made a big difference so far. I mean, we haven't seen much of Tricer. <laughs> the baby guy is still alive. Actually, where are the Deinonychus? And what happened to Gojirosaurus? Ooh. Oh no! Oh, what is an insta kill? That was lame. <laughs> Barra got wasted. Ooh, hang on. I want to watch this. Oh, is this Spinosaurus dead? The invincible Spinosaurus is getting, getting a beat down by Alpha Acrocamp. Look at it. It's been battered by the Alpha Acrocamphosaurus. Oh, Spinosaurus might not win. And well, I looked for Go Gojirosaurus, and he just died to Sorofacnax. But look at that, Alpha Acrocamphosaurus. Wait. Oh, wow. Wait, what do you have? Oh. Okay, so Alpha Acrocamphosaurus might actually win. What do you have? Okay, so you're just a base spiner. Oh, I think Papasaurus is about to die, but we're going to save that because Black T-Rex is taking on a Kark. Ooh, Karkirodontosaurus gets the first hit. Well, it did beat Terry in the anime, granted with Ace's help, but I think it was probably going to beat him anyway. Ooh. This is an interesting fight. Black T-Rex... Not looking good there, but it, the cock does retreat. Hmm, an interesting turn of events. If I were you, Triceratops, I'd probably run. Oh, look at the shant over here having a sleep. Oh, we got the Deinonychus still alive. Megalosaurus. Oh, Ulura Titan's still kicking. Although, Megalosaurus is eyeing him up. We got T Rex versus Ankylos. Oh my, oh my god. Wow. <laughs> Why are these carnivores so OP? Like, what did you have? Okay, so... Oh, okay, you're not very strong, but what did the T-Rex have? Intolerant, antisocial... Okay, so you're pretty decent. Oh, oh, I just jinxed the Ulura Titan. I said it was alive, but it's not anymore. And that actually, Black T-Rex hasn't killed anything. It's just injured them with internal bleeding, which doesn't actually count. And it did lose a fight. Ooh, Yangchungasaurus taking a cracker dealt the Dromius. We will get the first hit between these two. No one by the looks of it. Dealt the Dromius getting the first hit. Ooh, ooh, they're slowly backing up, tiptoeing. Having nose kisses and oh, <laughs> that's it. He just took a cheap shot and then ran. Wow, Apatosaurus has done well to survive. It was getting battered not long ago, but it's still alive and kicking with its tiny eyes. But Carcharodontosaurus has got something to say to that. Oh no! The baby boy is about to die! No, the Torvosaurus is going to get it! Oh, oh, look at it! Wait, what the hell was that? Just flung the thing! Oh, no, come on! If we get one shot the shant. Oh, Stegosaurus! Wait, if we can get. He killed the Spino! Spinosaurus gone! Stegosaurus making an impact! Unlike Woohoosaurus, which is probably going to die. Yep, down it goes. <laughs> Kark was just waiting for his moment. But, Sp but Spinosaurus is gone! Which means we're going to have a different winner for once. 
and the Apatosaurus has bit the dust as well. I can't believe Shant died in one hit. Ooh, now this would be a clash. Alpha Acrocanthosaurus against Black T-Rex. So the only Iguanodon variant we have left is Sorolophus. Oh, Soropelt they're taking on the Alpha Acrocanthosaurus. I don't think that's a good idea, buddy. Oh, look at it. It's gonna smoke it in one second. Look at it. Look at it. Oh, for goodness. <laughs> it killed the Soropelter instantly. It was an insta kill. How did you do? Oh dear. <laughs> it just got smoked. Ooh, this could be interesting. Yanchungosaurus taking on Mapusaurus. Yeah, the fire dinosaurs really dominate in this game. Oh, oh, what's happening? Something weird happened there. One of the, the animations glitch and... Uh... Okay, that was weird. Oh, Stegosaurus did endure a sprain against Spinosaurus here. But it was worth it to kill that pest. And make sure it doesn't win again. Well, we still have the Deinonychus gang. Who have done absolutely nothing. They might actually win by default if everyone kills each other. Ooh, Triceratops taking on Megalosaurus. Keeping a distance is not social distancing, lads. You gotta fight. But yeah, if the Deinonychus stay alive long enough and everyone kills each other, they might win. Although I'm pretty sure three Deinonychus aren't strong enough to kill something like a T-Rex, but against like something smaller like a Megalosaur. Oh, here we go. Here's the fight we want to see. Here's the fight we want to see. Alpha Acro taking on Black T-Rex. We never got this in the anime, but we're getting it here. Oh, no, no, the T-Rex is joining in. It's a 2v1. It's teaming up. Oh, I think Alpha Acro won that fight. Ooh, and gave the Black T-Rex some concussion to boot. Oh, the Torvosaurus is coming over. I think he's going to fight the T-Rex. Wait, what happened to Pachycephalosaurus? I think it died. I think it must have died ages ago. Because I haven't seen it. But then again, I'm not the most observant person. You're going to bite him or not? <laughs> They're just, like, snarling at each other. Oh, hang on. Oh, no. Another broken animation. Oh, oh, the Torvosaurus flopped, and that is it. Oh, oh, the Torvosaurus got the hit. And it's inflicted the T-Rex with organ trauma. Wait, he's going to kill it. That means T-Rex is going to go down. Oh, oh, there you are. You're just sleeping over here, apparently. Oh, you're skittish, that's why. <laughs> oh, the Anchungosaurus had dealt the Dromius eyeing each other up. Hmm. Oh, it's starving the Anchungosaurus. And it gets hit first. Oh, it's dead! Delta Dromi is killing our Yang Chungosaurus and putting an end to his reign of terror. And Yang Chungosaurus did quite a lot there. But Delta Dromi is landing a kill. The Megalosaurus is still in it. But it does have an ingrown claw, so it's not in the best of shapes. Is Kendrosaurus still alive? Oh, oh, I think this is the end of Megalosaurus. Ooh, hang on, I want to watch this. The Deinonychus gang finally gets some action. Oh, look at the T-Rex. He's just feeding and the Deinonychus are ripping him to shreds. Oh, now he's finally noticed the Deinonychus attacking him. Oh, is that it for T-Rex? I think that's it, the Deinonychus gang. The Alpha Deinonychus getting involved. Is this it for the T-Rex? Down it goes! The Deinonychus gang defeat the T-Rex. See, they're very clever Deinonychus. They're very clever animals. 
They'll wait for all the big carnivores to kill each other and then you'll kill, pick off whoever's left. Deinonychus got strategy. As opposed to these two that just want to kill each other with firebombs. I'm not going to go to that fight. We know that's going to end. Alpha Acrocanthosaurus is going to win. Because Kentrosaurus just can't do anything in this game. Oh, tiptoes, tiptoes. Mmm, the firebombs cancelling each other out, but it's Daspletosaurus that takes the win. And quite convincingly there. No surprise there, Kentrosaurus going down. Oh, I think Papasaurus is going to be the next victim of the Black T-Rex. Like, come on, it stands in zero chance against it. Black T-Rex could just step on it. Yes, you killed it, you bully. <laughs> oh dear, no recovering from that. Ooh, the Spino Killer taking on Torvosaurus. Stegosaurus is not going to win, is it? Well, it's not doing anything so far. They're just, like, sizing each other up. You're going to fight? Oh. Oh, no, the Torvosaurus got the first hit. Yeah, Torvosaurus is going to win. Yeah, they, yeah, that fight didn't last two seconds, eh? Ooh, Carcharodontosaurus versus Despletosaurus. Now, this, we've seen this fight quite... These two have fought each other quite a few times, actually, in during my uh, battle arenas and battle royales. They seem to like fighting each other. Oh, we've still got Majungasaurus. I've hardly seen anything from him. Fire cannons and fire bombs. But it looks like fire cannon reigns supreme. And with organ trauma, the Despletosaurus is done. Not good for Sorophagonax taking on the Alpha Acrocanthosaurus. And yes, I've moved everything up here now so they're more bunched together so I don't have to wait like an hour for someone to fight again. Oh look, they're having cuddles. Oh, is our Sorophagonax done? Oh, finally, Sorolophus gets in on the act. I think it's the first thing he's done. He's done nothing all arena. All throughout the whole video, Sorolophus has done absolutely nothing. And it continues to do nothing. And of course it gets bit first. Because herbivores suck in this game. Oh, now they all decide to fight each other. Oh, no, no, no. <laughs> Sorolophus came in just to die. Gorgosaurus landing it, adding another kill to his kill count. Despletosaurus is almost done. Okay, what did the Sorophagonax get? If I can buzzy highlight the thing. Oh, it's got laceration, it's done! Oh, laceration, which means that the Sorophagonax is eventually going to die. Ooh! Pachycephalosaurus getting in on the act and oh. Man, herbivores suck. And that is the end of Megalosaurus, killed by Majungasaurus. And in fact, that's his first victory in his first fight. But I think the favourite has got to be the Alpha Acrocanthosaurus, with six victories and four kills. This thing has been an absolute killing machine. Pachycephalosaurus went down like a lead balloon. The naff all this whole time, and then it just dies really sucks. Oh, it looks like the Sorophagonax is about is going to meet its end against Carcharodontosaurus. Whenever they get close to each when they get close enough to each other. Ooh, doubt the Dromy is taking on Torvosaurus over there. Oh, okay. They just walk past each other. Oh, don't look good for the Delta the Dromius, but he does land a bite on the Torv. 89% playing, 61%. Yeah, Torvosaurus, I think, is going to win this fight. And give it concussion. Oh, Mapusaurus, I think, is about to die. Because <laughs> it's got... Oh, no, it's got 100%. It actually fully healed. The Mapusaurus was on 9% when it lost this fight to um, the Spletosaurus, but it's fully recovered. But it's probably going to go back down to 9% after this fight. 
Yeah, definitely, yeah. Black T-Rex won that fight. Quite convincing. Well, based on the fact there's Alpha Acrocanthosaurus, this is probably the end of Stegosaurus. But, he did do his part, and he did kill the Spinosaurus. Concussion. He did some damage to it, I'll give him credit. And yes, I, for I forgot to give the Alpha Acro its Lux effect. Don't hate me. Oh, oh, what's it doing? Oh. Weird animation. Ooh, Triceratops though. Will it get a kill on Sorophaganax? Please kill it. It's, it's, got las it's lacerating and it's got 36% health. Oh, you did it! Come on, Triceratops, you can do it. You can do it, Triceratops. Oh, he hit him again! You can bust him up, finish him off, Trike. Oh, he got him! He got him! Down goes the Faganax! And that is another kill for the herbivores. And it's Triceratops smacking down Soro Faganax. So actually, who do we have left? So we have Triceratops being the only herbivore left. We have Allosaurus Atrox. We have Delt the Dromius. The Deinonychus Gang, Carcharodontosaurus, Alpha Acrocanthosaurus, Torvosaurus, Black T Rex, Macrosaurus, Gorgosaurus, and Majungasaurus. But I think Macrosaurus is about to bite the dust against the Gorg. Macrosaurus gonna get gored by the Gorgosaur? Ooh, the Deinonychus is. Oh, look at that! Down goes Mapusaurus. It was the Apex Champion in the Apex Arena video, but it dies to Gorgosaurus. Ooh, the Deinonychus not looking good. Is it hungry? Yeah, it's hungry. It can't eat because of all these large carnivores. It's like a feeder over there, you dumbass. But it just wants to eat from this one. Oh, oh, Black T-Rex is gone! Cockeradontosaurus finished him off. Black T-Rex out. And it's overwhelmed. Well, it ran out of power. We'll just say that. It ran out of power in the end. And Cockeradontosaurus picked him off. And it looks like Majungasaurus is about to get picked off by the Alpha Acro. Come on, Sunshine. Get it over with. Oh, he doesn't fight it. Oh, he doesn't want to fight him. Fair enough. And the Deinonychus, it, it got close to the feeder, but it got scared off by something. Like, there's another feeder over there, they just can't get to it. Oh, is he going to make it, or is the trike going to scare him off? Oh no, the Atrox is coming over there and it scared him off. He almost made it. Oh, look at this, they're fighting on top of the two dead carnivores. Gorgosaurus versus Torvosaurus. Oh, it's not looking good for Deinonychus. I think this is going to be the end of them. They just cannot get to a... F Ooh, both got minor fractures. They just... They both cannot get... They just cannot heal. And now this one's getting hungry. They're just panicking. The Aloatrox tappy and tactical scaring them off. And yeah, it's dying. Well, they did well. They put up... They killed the T-Rex. They had their moment in the spotlight. But it was always going to be a tough ask for them. Especially with all these big carnivores loitering around the feeders. It was always going to be tough. And I think this is going to be all she wrote for Triceratops. The last surviving herbivore. Oh, maybe not. Maybe not. Come on now, Trot. Come on. Try. Just hit him. No, he's done. And with a minor fracture as well, it's probably going to die from that as well. No, the Triceratops is done. Ooh, about Alpha Acrocanthosaurus is just not stopping. It's just fighting everything. It's taking on the Gorgosaurus now. But I don't think this is going to end well for Gorgosaurus. Ooh, will the Torvosaurus take a cheap shot? Yeah, yeah, he's not going to fight him. <laughs> he's like, yeah, I'm not fighting that. <laughs> Oh, is this, the, is this the end for Gorgosaurus? I think it's going to be. Gets a, gets a, gets a hit off, though. 
It can still do this. No, it doesn't look good. Three, tell you what, he puts up a good fight. He puts up a good fight, the Gorgosaurus here. Oh, he's got internal bleeding, it's done. Uh, internal bleeding, and he's knackered. So that will be Gorgosaurus going down. Let's see if the Deinonychus... Well, this one will survive. Oh, he's actually fed. So we do have a Deinonychus left, but... Oh, look at him. going to get a cheeky little snack there. But this one didn't fare so well and is about to die. So, yeah, that's that's it for the Deinonychus since one... Well, it can't fight. It, be, it can't fight anything. It's just going to run around like a headless chicken. So, who do we have left? So, we have Triceratops, Carcharodontosaurus, Gorgosaurus, which is going to die, Deltadromius... Aloatrox, Alpha Acrocamphosaurus, Torvosaurus, and Majungasaurus are our top eight. So Deinonychus did make it in the top ten. So I'll give it props for that. And I think Black T Rex came in tenth. And Triceratops did make a top ten finish. So I'll give it credit. But that is probably going to be it for the Triceratops because it stands zero chance against this Kark. Which has been an abs which has been a mean green killing machine. Ah, oh, poor Triceratops. He's just recovered his health, and now he's got concussion. Oh wow, you actually are really strong. I think it's going to come down to Alpha Acrocamphosaurus and Carcharodontosaurus. I think those two have the best chance of winning. Oh, and it looks like Torvosaurus is going to finish the job on Gorgosaurus. Perhaps? Maybe? Maybe? Yeah, there it is. Oh, nom, nom. And that's Gorgosaurus coming in eighth. And now we are down to seven. So Deinonychus, I mean, all the Deinonychus has to die first, but I'll say it came in ninth because this one Deinonychus can't do anything. Oh, we've got a double fight here. we got Delta Dromius taking on the Kark. Is that good? It's not wise. Delta Dromius one-shotted by the Kark. Oh, the Delta Dromius is on full HP and he got smoked by the true apex of Africa. So that's Delta Dromius coming in seventh. And we are down to six. Well, five technically. Oh, hello, hello, hello. We've got Alpha Acrocamphosaurus taking on Torvosaurus, perhaps? Oh, we do! And it's Acro gets the first hit, because of course it does. Ooh, this could be interesting. You don't want to sustain an injury now. Oh, hang on. Is that Torvosaurus dead? Oh, no, they were just having cuddles. But Alpha... Wait, what? Took no damage? Oh, no. I think Triceratops is about to meet its end. Carcharodontosaurus is coming in. Yeah, even with an, even with the, its injuries, Triceratops is going to die. Oh, maybe not. Triceratops prolonging death by a few more minutes. Well, the Deinonychus is going to starve to death. It just can't get to the feeder. That's weird. There have been some weird bugged fights like that. Alpha Acrocamphosaurus taking zero damage. Oh no, the Majungasaurus is starving as well. It just can't get to the food. It can't get to its feeder. It just can't do it. All these big carnivores are in the way. It needs to just go over and sneak a snack or try and pick off the Deinonychus if it dies, when it dies, because the Deinonychus is going to die. Oh no, the Triceratops is gone. <laughs> well, it, it lasted longer than practically all the other herbivores, and it did kill, and it did kill something. So we'll give it props for that, but yeah, like all the other herbivores, they just stand very little chance of winning. Uh, I think this is the end of... Yep. Yeah. Oh my god, he killed it instantly. <laughs> it's the end of Majungasaurus. 
Triceratops comes in sixth place and does win out of all the herbivores, so we'll give it props for that. And in fifth place, by virtue of the fact that it did naff all, bar kill one thing, is Majungasaurus. And we are down to our four dinosaurs. We have Carcharodontosaurus, Allosaurus Atrox, Torvosaurus and Alpha Acrocanthosaurus. Who will win out of these four? Well, we could be here a while because they just don't want to fight each other. I'm tempted to take away the feeder. I'd be like, yeah, sod it. You're not, you're not, you're not having anything. Oh, hang on. Nope, we got to fight. Aloatrox taking on Acro. Just when I say they won't fight, they start fighting. Yum! Ooh, it does open the door for the card, perhaps? Are they gonna. Will Acro actually take damage this time? 78 playing 78! But! But he's got internal bleeding! Allo Atrox! Well, it was a tie. It was a tie! But the Allosaurus Atrox has internal bleeding, which means it is going to die! Oh, is that, that's it for Atrox? So, yeah, Atrox is gonna come in fourth really do much it was just there like Majungasaurus but yeah Aloatrox is going to come in fourth which means our top three is Carcharodontosaurus, Torvosaurus and Alpha Acrocanthosaurus and Deinonychus finally popped its clogs oh, is this the end for Allosaurus Atrox I think it's going to be oh my god it's an insta kill you know good put it out of its misery Alpha Acrocanthosaurus laying another beat down and Allosaurus Atrox comes in fourth. And that is victory number nine for Alpha Acrocanthosaurus. And kill number six. And I think it's killed the most out of all these carnivores. Ooh, Kark does have eight victories. Five kills overall. And Torvosaurus, wherever you are. has six victories, one defeat, five kills. And I think is about to take on the Carcharodontosaurus. Oh! Oh, has he killed it? He's killed the cock! Insta-kill from the Torvosaurus. And Carcharodontosaurus finishes in third. Which means we are down to our final two. Torvosaurus and Alpha Acrocanthosaurus. Okay, so here's where things get a bit complicated. But basically, I, I was at it for about almost an hour. And for whatever reason, the Torvosaurus and the Alpha Acrocanthosaurus just didn't want to fight each other. So I, I decided, so I put that down to the fact that two Acrocanthosauruses can coexist with each other and they won't fight. They won't fight to the death. I checked the main OVL that, and checked all the Acro stats and my assumptions were correct. So I turned, so I changed it so that they can only have one Acrocanthosaurus in the arena. And if there's more, they'll fight each other. So I did that. I opened the game again, then the game crashed. And not only did the game crashed, but I lost the save file I had up to the point where there was just them two left. Which is why we are in an empty battle arena with Nafal in it. Well, this is this is an old this is a backup save file that I have with all the dinosaurs loaded up ready. For that reason, I am going to give the win to Alpha Acrocanthosaurus on the basis that it killed more it had more victories than the Torvosaurus and I think overall it had better stats than the Torvosaurus so I think if they did fight each other I'm pretty confident that Alpha Acrocanthosaurus would have won so I am gonna say Alpha Acrocanthosaurus is the winner and Torvosaurus will definitely get a respectable second place
So, yeah, that was not the way I wanted to end this session, but there we, <laughs> but there we go. That's, that's modding for you. <laughs> so, yeah, I hope you enjoyed. If you did, please leave a like, pop a comment down below, and yeah, we'll, defi we'll definitely have to do another one now, won't we? So we can have a definitive winner. And I will play around with the stats and that off camera, so hopefully we won't have any of this trouble again. And until next time, ta-ta!